Tomorrow is Superstar Tuesday, and I want to thank you all. I tell you what, I'm rushing ahead, aren't I? 150 million people have been killed since 2007 when Bernie voted to exempt the gun manufacturers from liability. It would put 720 million back, million women back in the workforce. Nobody should be in jail for nonviolent crime. My name's Joe Biden. I'm a Democratic candidate for the United States Senate. What's not to like about Vermont in terms of the beauty of it? And what a neat town. Play the radio. Make sure the television, excuse me, make sure you have the record player on at night. Poor kids are just as bright and just as talented as white kids. We choose science over fiction. We choose truth over facts. Think about it. We hold these truths to be self-evident. All men and women were created by the go, you know the you know the thing. I got a lot of I got hairy legs that turn that 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 that, that, that turn uh, 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 blonde in the sun. And the kids used to come up and reach in and pull and rub my leg down so it was straight and then watch the hair come back up again. They look at it. So I learned about roaches, I learned about kids jumping on my lap. And I've loved kids jumping on my lap. Corn Pop was a bad dude. And he ran a bunch of bad boys. And I did change. And back in those days, you know how things have changed. One of the things that you do is if you use pomades, you're going to have to wear a bathing cap. And who is up on the board wouldn't listen to me. Hey, Ed, you, you, off the board. I'm going to come and drag you off. Well, he came off, and he said, I'll meet you outside. My car, this is mostly this is all public housing behind me. My car, there was a gate on you. I parked my car outside the gate, and I said, I'll be waiting for you. Wait for three guys from straight Ridge. Not a joke. There's a guy named Bill Wright, pal. The only white guy, and he did all the school. He was the mechanic. And I said, what am I going to do? He said, come down here in the basement where the mechanic was where we're all full filler is. You know the chain, you can get chained and went across the deep end. And he cut off the six foot by the chain and pulled up and you walk out with that chain. And you walk to the park. And I made I mean it sincerely. He looked at me and said, one hunky is just as fast as any other, I'll take whoever you send me. And here's what I want to tell you about Earl. Here's what I'm telling you about the neighbor in the heart. I defended him. He got beat up right on, on the other side of the field here. He walked along the track. Then was there was uniform the guy we beat up and robbed. And so I thought he was innocent. I kept the jury out five hours. But they convicted him. I felt so bad. I go down to the old prison all the time. Then little wooden chairs, little two little chairs, and a big doll that you'd sit under where you'd be interviewed. And I was sitting there counseling, and I was the third time, and I'm appealing to tape. And finally, he took the tape, and he flipped it up, and he just jumped up, and the guard came and grabbed him. He said, don't you understand, Joe? I did it. I did it. But here's the point. He cared about me. This is a man who saw me bleed because I saw this guy going to jail, and I thought he was innocent. There's character. Even in great, great problem, problem.